we're not going to get away with this, are we? What did you do? Did I you... did it. It was me. Why, why did you did this? I, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Come on. Pull. Well, now we have to pull out this transistor. <laughs> there. Together again. So, um, that was a dude. Sort of. That, that was a dude. Yeah, that's a dude. You just pulled it out of... Yeah. I don't know anything about this game. Oh, uh, by the way, um, hey kids, that was clear, and You're I'm so beat. Man. Yeah, that, that's the thing we're doing here. Yeah. And we pulled a transistor out of some dude's body. Mm -hmm. That probably wasn't a thing we wanted to have happen, but so it goes. And over here is hopefully not murder. Thanks. Already. No, you're gonna get murdered. They want you back. We all know murder. You know, I I still have not played this game, which is ironic considering that at two separate PAXs I waited in line like an hour before saying screw it and not playing so it. Why? So I still haven't played it. And even though you can buy it now, like for your computer, it, your it, Xbox. Yeah, it's a good game. You should you should buy it. I don't wanna. You buy it for me. Maybe I will. Nice. Don't. Don't, okay, don't throw go. your money away, to, oh, Don't do that to bag. yourself. Okay, so how's the combat in this work? Because it's see, like, like Bastion, except completely different, except completely the same. It's, by the way, yes, this is Transistor, in case anyone was wondering what the hell was going on. Transistor is made by the same people who made Bastion, which is why I'm Let's Playing it now. I it's thought it was Conduit. I don't know what they're talking about, man. Conduit <laughs> something completely different. Oh. Well, well, what about semiconductor? Nah, right. uh, no, I don't think we're doing that. But yeah, oh. as you can see, it's like Bastion at first, but then this happens. Do something. Okay, so you're on the grid. I'm, I'm on the grid. This is kind of like that thing they do in Fallout, where you can just take the time to pause the game and allocate actions, and then you unpause and. Red, which is what this protagonist's name is, she just does the stuff way too fast for anything to do anything about it. Like so. So doing that killed one guy and badly damaged the other guy. Ready? Yes. Which is uh, pretty good. However, the turn function that is what it is has a significant cost in that while it's recharging, you can't do stuff. You can run away from things, but that's about it. So you kind of have to balance out having turn available but not using it and just using your basic functions, slow though they are, and then Clear. using turn when you absolutely need to just turn the world into a scorched, smoking crater. See, I'm not sure, and maybe this is just because I am a disgusting, um, uh, there. plebeian, maybe, that's not the right word. Hello world. What's like, what's like somebody who doesn't appreciate art? That? Philistine! Ah! Uh, but if it's an action game, and it is an action game to an yeah. extent, uh, it, it's really important that you have at least some moves that come out quickly that you can just use in normal play. The idea of the, empty set. the idea of only being able to do Still fast to stuff by entering this menu time. seems very backwards to me. There but, are some fast moves you can unlock later. This is just we've only got the two moves now. Okay, cool. Because this, like Bastion, we'll be getting a whole bunch of cool moves, and they'll all be having their own different uses, like. We're about to get one here from that dead person. Ah. First things first, though. Kill some people. Yep. Well, not people. Uh, robots. They remind me kind of of the portal turrets, actually. That they do have that look to them. They're called the process in the game. Anyway, we've process. only got one left, so let's just club it over the head repeatedly until it falls down. We can backstab it by hitting it from behind. My dog is being very affectionate right now. That's a bad time for your dog to be affectionate. Is she awake? There, there's a person who is now a cube. Hi. That seems okay? like a bad thing to be, if you don't mind my saying. Yeah, yeah, she, she had a very bad day. But now she's going to help us by giving us explosions. As you see down at the bottom, we have a new function called Spark. Okay. We we're gonna use it in just a second, but right now I want to go check the terminal. Which lets you do save or maybe read the news. It lets us vote on what kind of weather we want to have. Oh, okay. That's how Cloud Bank works. Ah. Not even on the ballot. 
I'm gonna go with clouds because I don't know what's happening, but clearly something's going wrong, and I just don't want to attract attention. Ah. Mild and inoffensive. Does that like matter? Like, Where like will we? the weather effects actually like affect gameplay, or is it just like a need um, uh... It's mostly there for flavor. Uh, right. The guy who's talking right now will actually no like problem. provide commentary on it. The guy who is our sword, or is in our sword, or I really don't know. So, so you're telling me we literally can make small talk with our sword about the weather? Uh, the sword can talk to us. We can't talk back. <laughs> that, like that. But yes. Without big fashion week not happening, huh? Oh, let's learn about the fashion week. Oh, I love fashion week. Love. Dressing up in my snazziest tux, strutting out, making all the ladies go, ooh. Yeah, look at, look at her fancy hat. Don't you want a fancy hat like that? I got a fancy hat. Big old top hat. I'm a skeleton. That's what we do here. Of course. I to keep heading east. All right. And that, that's there is the spark function. It hits a pretty big area. does okay damage. We also have the crash function, which is a melee attack. A little slow, but it stuns things. It hits. And Breach, which is the giant laser I've been using basically every so every single action. They took your voice. I so Red, if that's her real name, well, we took something is us. pretty popular. Yeah, she was a singer, but that's ah. complicated because she lost her voice. Someone yeah, took it. kind of sucks for her. Damn, young lady here to see you. Here's a new thing. All right. When it gets hit, it teleports. Which is a problem if you go into turn and then use all your stuff on it, because then the first thing will hit, and then she'll teleport, and you'll just swing in the air repeatedly. However, our crash function, as I mentioned, it stuns, so since I hit with crash just before we went into turn, I could actually, you know, do stuff. So, like, do you know when you're doing your weird little pause setup moves thing, um, where, like, it will teleport to? Or does it... Does it just, does the game just go, I don't know, man. It just randomly teleports her somewhere. A lot of people will play the game just using turn as their sole mode of offense, immediately using it when they get it. That's not the best way to approach it, but I can understand why people do it, because it's really friggin' good. I don't know, being much more from, like, the Devil May Cry uh, school of thought when it comes to video games... I don't know, I, I sort of like, like, like when I heard about the Fallout uh, system where, oh, you can pause and not shoot, I'm like, that's ridiculous, why on earth would you do that? Oh, here it's also a puzzle, one, two. Yep, that, puzzles are not the main thing in this game, this is basically the only time they do this. Uh, okay, show you that you can do it, essentially. Yeah. That's not a bad way to teach a mechanic. Hey, Mr. Moyle, you in there? It's another cube person. No, he's not. Maybe he's a cylinder? Whatever. Uh, we have downloaded him into our sword as well, and now we have to go fast. Okay, so you got the dash. Yep. Pretty cool. This one can actually be used even when turn is recharging, oh, no. so... Good. Excellent. See, that makes me happy. I like dashing. The game's not a game unless you got a dash button. Exactly. Or unless it's Sonic. Tough guy. Or Mario. Or a lot of the games, really. Yeah. Oh well. Anyway, this guy is large and in charge, so let's cheat. Hit him from behind to break. Te teleport over there with a the jaunt, and then lasers. And yeah, as you can see, we can still use jaunt even when turn is recharging. Cool. So I'm gonna get far enough away and then laser spam. So what's with the um uh, big like white pillars just that just sort of come out of the ground. Those are... They're a sort of type of like the turret enemies, except they don't actually form any kind of hostility. They're just walls, basically. But they are related. So it's like Gears of War, then? Sure. Buttons, like chest-high walls come out of the ground. Hey. Yes, and I like. Breach can go through them, and now we can download a new function. Like, such as? Well, we have Bounce, which is, it bounces off of stuff, or we have Mask, which goes invisible. And I'm going to leave this up to the thread with a voting thing I'm going to be doing, which basically 
We're still here. All the functions in here are cool, but I'll use them however the thread thinks is interesting. Alright. And there is a lot of ways to okay, use them. Like, we can equip them like we normally do, like we have our first four functions equipped as active, or we can equip them as upgrades, which I'll show off with bounce and a couple others real quick. So, basically you can take any function you have and apply it to another function as an upgrade. We apply it to breach, it'll bounce off walls, we apply it to spark, it'll do multiple explosions, so on and so forth. Rad. Alright, neat. And of course that's not just with bounce, like, I'm actually gonna uninstall breach from its normal thing here, cause it's, it's nice, but it's not my favorite as an active function. I'm going to install bounce where it was. I'm going to install breach as an upgrade to something else, just for the sake of demonstration. Like, if someone, if the thread votes we really want to see mask instead, I'll use that instead, but yeah, now, now our crash function has breach as an upgrade to it. I Good. barely understood just that. Well, now oh, our geez. melee sword attack that we used to have can do this. Oh, that's pretty nice. Long range, and now there's bounce. Looks promising. Cool. Maybe not for your knees. Anyway, I think that'll do it for now. So yeah, vote in the thread and as to what kind of functions you want to see. I'll list them all out for you. And that'll do it for now. This has been Let's Play Transistor. Bye. Bye.